at 7.03. Okay. Any public input this evening? Would you like to introduce yourself? <laughs> uh, um, my name is Shayla Holland from St. Anselm College. I'm a nursing major and as part of my um, senior classes, we have to investigate a community, so my group is doing the push field, and I'm responsible for the environmental aspect. Okay. <laughs> Can you listening. just give me your name one more oh. time? Uh, Wait, Shayla. I have it. I have it. Oh, down. Okay. Thank you. Because she was at another meeting. <laughs> oh, welcome. Okay, old business drone, fish and game, river access. Okay, so a while ago, I think it was right after our last meeting, I emailed my contact, Rich Cook, at Fish and Game, and this was his comment. I copied his comment right out of his email that he feels the cost. Well, the guy who came down here, the geologist, whose name's Garrett, felt that the cost of making the site across from the library or actually Jefferson's site, usable for the kind of boat access he envisions for that part of the Merrimack is too high. He is currently exploring other options along that stretch of the river. So, didn't look too hopeful. What was he looking for as far as? They want motorboat access. Oh. And that stretch oh. of river isn't going to support a motorboat. Yeah, we, we just wanted to carry on. Yeah, right. yeah, that's what it originally was but supposed to be. But I guess if they mm. put that much money into it, then they want, I guess, Fishermen, fishermen could get in a car top boat, right. mm -hmm. but that was the because when he was there, he said, "Well, this is what we'd have to do to make it motorboat accessible." And then he looked at the river section and realized it's pretty bony out there. That would just be what we could it's river boat, motorboat accessible. Some weeks it would be, some weeks it wouldn't yeah, be. Right, right now, it's <laughs> more yeah. accessible. Depends on the time of the year. Or That's right. Water. That's right. Yeah. Mm. Just f fish accordingly. Yeah. That was mm -hmm. Okay. Winterfest, Winterfest suggestions. So the brave souls went to Winterfest. Sharon, no, really? On Sunday? Sharon I couldn't and Richard. No, I didn't go. You didn't go? No, I couldn't get out of my driveway because we got all that snow. Oh, down. well, Richard went. Yeah. Richard went. Marion right? went. You didn't. Marion. Well, he really? Had to go, you know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 back door. Yeah. And so how many people showed up? If I had to drive 20 minutes, I might have thought about it. Yeah, right. So how many people um, showed up? 71 signed up for snowshoeing. I don't think there were two groups. I don't think there were more than 20, probably. That's, even that is amazing. Yeah, yeah no, no. I mean, people, had, wow. people that showed up had fun. And, mm. It was good. And EMS brought snowshoes? Or some? Well, there was some sort of a snafu or confusion with EMS, and the rec someone from the Rec Commission had to drive up to Concord or something Saturday night oh, to EMS to get them. I think, the, I guess the EMS thought it was another day or something. Mm -hmm. But they did get snowshoes. They did get them, though, yeah. Didn't have poles, just snowshoes. Just snow <laughs> <laughs> well, at my age, you need the poles, too. <laughs> and I wondered, and I think I had mentioned this to the person that was running that part of it. Next year, if they have that many people, don't you think they should have like timed set t set times to come? Not oh, just well, 78 people 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock, 12 o'clock. Yeah. probably does make more sense, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, because yeah, if you get everybody just standing around, and especially well, in a cold, you know, winter day. Right, mm -hmm. and you have no idea if some. I mean, just saying it, it's open, it's until one o'clock. I mean, you don't want to have somebody show up at five minutes at one. So I want to go for my walk now. Right. right? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Or pipe will have eleven, and then not have enough snowshoes or whatever. Mm -hmm. How long does it take to go around the pond? Not very long. Yeah, it was a very short path, probably fifteen minutes. Yeah. Did, did you go all the way around the whole pond? No, no. Um, basically. It was just sort of um, around the field area there, um, oh. where they On kind the of do the park? dog sledding. You know, they come back around the, the loop. Because it was field. all that fresh snow, right? And close, mm -hmm. yeah, well, yeah. And well, they did pack it down some with uh, snowmobiles before. Oh, they the, did, yeah. The snowshoeing, but and also they we pretty much stuck around the um, the woods. Mm -hmm. On the, oh, so the, the fringe of the pond. Oh, the wind was horrible. Yeah, yeah. Didn't <laughs> go out in the open. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Well, that's good. See what they do next year. Yep. New business. Map two, lot eighty eight. Okay, so I had sent um this afternoon after I sent the agenda. This did everybody get this with titled page wrote on top? No. Nope. Send this one down to I didn't get that. Yeah. You didn't get that? No, nope, that didn't come through. I just shut my computer off when I left. Richard, did you get it? Send one down to Roger. That's basically what um, Jason. She has a, she has, oh, okay. What sure. Jason had told the um, selectmen about the meeting that we had with Rick Charbonneau. 
and um, for the viewing public. It's 95 acres on Page Road um, that Rick owns. And what they probably will do is work in phases and get the sand out of it, although it is a pretty level site. Uh, they feel they could still be able to stay above the groundwater and get the sand out of it and and then donate it to the town. And as they go, they can do different things on the land. And he wants to get a committee, Jason and Rick want to get a committee going to see what what would be good on that parcel of land. And I tried to call um, Hudson and Benson's. They never got back to me to see how big Benson's is. And I think it's, Benson's may be a little bigger, but compared